Pac-Man wouldn't be Pac-Man if he didn't move around the maze collecting prizes. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to put a couple of sprites in as prizes and add a score so that when Pac-Man collects them, they hide and his score goes up. So what we're going to do is add a new sprite. I'm going to use one of the ones from a file and you can choose anything you want. So let's try a thing. What can we have? What can Pac-Man collect? Uh, a party hat, that'll do. Okay, I'm going to pop that in. Again, I'm going to make it a bit smaller. So it fits. And I'm going to pop it over here in this corner. Now, I need um, a script for that sprite which says, be visible, but if Pac-Man touches you, hide. So, I'm going to call this one Hat. And in the scripts panel, make sure I've got it selected, I'm going to write this. When the green flag is clicked, um, where are we? Where's my show? Must be in looks. Yeah, there we go. Show. And then I'm going to put a forever loop in and an if loop inside that so forever and if now sensing if it's touching pac-man so where's my touching there we go touch if touching pac-man and if you haven't got pac-man here that means you've selected pac-man and you write in this script for him instead of for the hat so if touching pac-man then go back to looks and choose hide there we go. That's it. Now what we need to do is put a score in so that when Pac-Man gets the hat, his score goes up. So the first thing we're going to do is go to variables and make a variable. I'm going to call it score. There we are. And my score will appear on the stage. I'm going to put it somewhere where it's not going to get in the way. So I'm going to put score there. So, now what we need to do is change the score when the sprite, when Pac-Man touches the prize, touches the hat. So, here, under hide, I'm going to put change score by 1, like so. Now, we could even have booby prizes, things to be avoided, poison pills or whatever, that would change the score by minus 1 instead. Um, so what I'm going to do, I could do that again and again and again and put lots of different prizes around. I'm going to let you have a go at that. I'm going to stop this video now. But when I come back, I'll have put several other prizes around the maze. So have a go.